Hey boys and girls, what's up? I'm Don Lillian and this here is my GoPro Hero camera frame which I use for my GoPro Hero 3 camera and it opens and closes so you can easily remove and put your camera back in it. I do like the concept but considering the cost of this thing I think it broke way too easy so I wanted another one but I didn't want to pay the money for one of these when it's just gonna break again so I made my own and obviously I 3D printed it looks like this and it may not be as pretty as the original one but you got the function so you can open it remove your camera and put it somewhere else if you want and you can just put it back in there and it fits snugly in place and while it does fit fairly secure or really really well uh, I wouldn't use this for anything other than static applications because if you put it on a helmet if you put it uh, while snowboarding or BMXing mountain biking or whatever and this thing opens your camera is gonna be gone so uh, I only use it for static use maybe you should too but of course you're free to do whatever you want so this one is printed in a you need to print it in somewhat uh, flexible material and this is protopasta's pre-release pet G which will introduce just the right amount of flex so you can open it like this put the camera in easily and this the locking mechanism needs to be able to flex as well to come into place and of course to be able to uh, to open it uh, so you can't you won't be able to print it in pla for example because it's not gonna it's not gonna work um, if you do print it in a not as flexible material as a copolyester this one is from protopasta it's called engine this is not as flexible it is flexible as you can see but not as much as the protopasta pet g so i just had to cut off a little piece to the edge here and smooth out the round part as well and now it's it fits perfectly just gonna like this So we put the camera in the frame like that and there you go. So if you want to have a go at this yourself, I'll put a link down in the description and uh, you can download it and 3D print it. If you have any problems, uh, you have some questions, let me know in the comments or tag me on social media. And uh, if you like this video, if you like this project, give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss out on any future products as well. So that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.